hanging out here in our Panda Kitchen studios with the wonderfully talented Chef Adrian. I I'm feeling like seafood. Well, I've got the thing for you. Yes. We're doing a wild salmon coated with brown sugar, maximum flavor style. Yeah, yeah. I like that. We're going to start with a hot skillet. I'm going to put a little bit of canola oil, about a tablespoon. And then here I have a nice piece of salmon filet, which I'm going to rub with brown sugar. Now I do the sugar first so that when it cooks, it'll have a nice caramelized coat on it. I feel like brown sugar on salmon is not something that I hear a lot of. Well, it's a lot more common than you, than you think, but okay. it's, oh wow, it's, to me it's the best way to have salmon. Here we go, and we give it a nice coating of this Maximum Flavor Chef's Dust. There we go. And then when the pan is almost smoking, we put it seasoning side down first for a, for a few seconds. There we go. Now, we get, now it's really soaking up the seasoning in the whole pan. Absolutely, now. it's caramelizing. Right. Okay, so now here we get a tea pan ready. And let's see if it's ready. There that we fast. go. That fast. Wow. And it goes into the tea pan and into the oven. We've heated it up for, let me see, we got it at 350 degrees. And this is going to cook real fast 10 minutes for a medium rare. In the meantime, you're going to make our lovely sauce. That's right. I thought you would never ask. I even had the sleeves rolled up and everything. You're ready to go then. Yes. Okay. So we got some wasabi mustard. Boom. Now, be careful. This is real complicated, guys. I think, are you patronizing me? Is that, is that what just happened there? And now you're going to add some soy sauce. <laughs> All of it? All of it. Good. Okay. Okay. Now we're going to add some chef's dust and a little more brown sugar. Okay. Okay. Now mix that together. Okay. This is really real complicated. Hard. Do not real try this at home. Guys. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I like to go with a, a clockwise rotation. There you go. Some people go counterclockwise. I find clockwise works better. Yeah, I'm gonna keep doing this. All right, so when all the granules are dissolved, you're all set. Perfect, let's, I think it's time to check the oven. <laughs> so after about 10 minutes or so, oh, perfect. We have our nice golden salmon filet. Beautiful, okay. And you've done that wonderful sauce. So we plate it right on top. I like to plate it on top of organic baby spinach and a little bit of red cabbage for crunch. And very now, colorful. Very colorful. And now your sauce. Just pour it over. All right. Be generous. Don't be shy. No, nah, don't be stingy. Don't be stingy. Yes. You I actually want to pour it in a way where I can do my initials, but I don't think I'm ready for that <laughs> just yet. Dave, you're such a wonderful chef. Oh, no. I'm the sous chef. You <laughs> are the wonderful chef. And there you have it. Our wild salmon filet, maximum flavor style. And if you want to get the ingredients and the recipe on how to do this, just go to southflorida.com slash food. Chef Adrian is always so amazing, and this dish looks really delectable, and we are going to pig out right now in our Panda Kitchen Studios.